Hey everyone, Scar Predator of Online. Thanks for watching. Um, today I just uh, I still can't do very much heavy lifting, so I've just been doing a little bit of maintenance. So I've sorted out my roaches. Uh, so the W roaches, the Dubia roaches on top. Um, new roach chow, new water. They're gonna have oranges tonight. Uh, the red runners on the bottom, really doing well exploding uh, so they're gonna have oranges tonight and i've had a new box just on the right there for the uh hissing cockroaches so jessica blake i've added them to the ones i had here already and uh exactly the same setup so egg crates carbon egg crates water crystals bug chow you know the one i make myself and they'll all have fruit tonight now i haven't got any in the house Claire will pick some up on her way home. So I'm going to video that as well because the red runs go mental over it. So I'm thinking now what I can do, you know, light stuff, I don't have to bend. And I've popped down, um, this is the enclosure for the Postal Theory of Metallica that had, eggs, that had an egg sack. Um, and unfortunately, looking through the back, I know you can't, there's no hole there, but it shines light through. It looks like she's either dead or molted. The egg sac's gone. So I thought I could, um, with you guys, just have a look, um, a cheeky cheeky look. So um, cool. I'll plod on with this. I'll see if I can move the camera and capture. If she's molted, not the end of the day. I've got a male here. We'll give her one more shot. Well, one more shot. One more shot, yeah, and then we'll retire her. Um, the big female uh, that we got here looks to be molting, so it's made up loads of web everywhere. It's sitting in a bowl in the back. Uh, it hasn't been mated, so it's not going to drop an egg sac. So the only other, obviously, logical assumption is that it's going to molt. Not a bad thing. Not a bad thing at all. Uh, this is absolutely gutting, though. Because uh, there's definitely no egg sac in there anymore. Uh, I can see remnants of web sac, sac material, you know. So uh, it's not going great at the moment, Jiv, but you know, these things happen. Let's uh, have a look at this one. Okay, so I'm holding the, uh, the GoPro now. I'm going to go for an inside look into it. See if we can just move her. Without. Oh. Pop that like that. What are we going to try and do? See, there's no egg sac in there. Can you see anything to the back? Oh, well, that's good news. Is I can see legs there. Can you see any legs? Let's try and shine a torch down. We might be able to see. Just there, there's her legs there. So she's alive. She is alive, that's good. Let's uh, open up some of this. Let's start with uh, just taking some of this webbing away. See her. Is there a mold in there? No, there's no mold in there either. So she's not molded. She has not molded. Let's see if we can. God, it's difficult for this camera with the GoPro. But okay, so she's not dead. She hasn't molted. She's just eaten the egg sac. And uh, she's still there. So what we'll do, make sure we can put it back without disturbing her too much. That's fine. See what I mean about pokies, if they go into the egg sacs or they go into molt, there's web everywhere.
Okay, so while there, we, obviously we don't keep disturbing her too much. So let's uh, give her a good spray in. Really good spray in. It's proper dry in there. And let's fill this water bowl up. Overspill it a little bit. Overfill it. Okay, not the best outcome, but not a bad outcome really. Um, just lost an egg sac again. This female, uh, I gotta be honest, I've tried three times with her now. She's, she really doesn't keep egg sacs very well. Uh, so yeah, we'll definitely retire this one and we'll start giving a shot on the, on the, new, on the new female. So again, so thanks for joining me. Um, light duties still uh, but um, at least now I'm allowed to be in the spider room just a little bit not lifting anything uh, thanks guys remember to like comment subscribe uh, keep sharing these videos especially that tiny uh, egg sac video that's gotta go long more people need to see that it's, it's a hell of a hell of a video even if I don't you know do say so myself Cool, thanks everyone. Uh, quick advert for the Desert of Wolf Spider. Hi YouTube, uh, it's Gar Predra Pre Online. So um, this year, uh, the channel is going to be supporting um, a really good cause. So we're going to be supporting the Desertus Wolf Spider Conservation Project through Bristol Zoo, so the um, Hogna Ingens uh, from Madeira. So we're going to raise money all through the year for them. And um, we're going to run some sales. So some of the stuff that I breed from the spider room, I will uh, sell um, through the channel and through the web uh, through the website and the Facebook, and I'll say exactly uh, that this sale, all proceeds will go to the um, Madeira, you know, the wolf spider, so the uh, the uh, desert this wolf spider charity. Um, also, I'll be running raffles, and I've run, I'm running one raffle right now to win five um, Fidibus Regius, the regal jumping spider jumplings uh, and there's like 13 numbers left out of 50 so that's really doing really well uh, also as well if you're outside of the EU obviously I can only post in the EU so in Britain and in Europe uh, so if you're in like America or Australia or wherever you guys are and you still want to help out with the, the project that through the Facebook page if you go there there's a link there for um, donations that go straight to Bristol Zoo um, it's a really cracking project. Uh, I know that Invitros UK uh, are raising money for them as well, and I just think it's something that uh, you know, as hobbyists, we can give back as well. And they'll be doing, as I say, conservation work, so captive breeding programs at Bristol Zoo, and also um, helping to protect the, uh, the the area of where they are as well in Madeira. And it's really, really good cause. Cheers, guys.